Hi everyone, I know what you are looking for exactly and that's what I'm gonna give you in this tutorial. Just with some clicks and some numbers, you can simply share your phone VPN to any console that you have. No root needed, no need to use Wi-Fi hotspot or any other cable. That's what you want, right? Let's get into it. But there is one important tip. You can't share any VPN to console that you like. Because some VPNs doesn't allow the user to share them through their phone or through proxies. So what I recommend you to check the VPNs that I did mention in the comments below and use a VPN that supports sharing. For example, the one that I'm gonna use in this tutorial supports sharing through proxy. I don't have any issue. But if you are using some free VPNs or some VPNs that they doesn't let you to share them, it will not work. Step one, connect your phone to Wi-Fi router. If you are using SIM card connection on your phone like 3G or 4G connection, I'll explain about it at the end of the video but first I'm gonna explain for the ones that they are using Wi-Fi on their phone. I connected my phone to this router also make sure that your phone isn't connected to any VPNs yet. Step 2. Connect your console to the same router. You can connect it by LAN cable or Wi-Fi both of them will work step 3 check your console and phone gateway to check your console gateway you need to go to the connection settings in ps4 it's in network settings you can find it in other consoles as well for example you can see my ps4 gateway is 192 168 105 1. for the phone gateway you need to go to the wi-fi settings and check the information for example here you can see in my phone the gateway is the same as the ps4 because they are connected to the same router step 4 let's get through every proxy app settings open every proxy application on your phone tap on three dots on top right and go to the settings choose the ip address which is using the gateway here I chose 192, 168, 105, 78 because it's the same gateway as I'm using for the console and for the phone. I chose them for both HTTP and SOX proxies. So this way you can share VPN through proxies to your router and then use it on your consoles. Also make sure to choose different ports for SOX proxy and HTTPS. For example, for HTTP I chose 8080 and for SOX proxy I chose chose 1080. Go back to application menu and turn HTTP HTTPS proxy on. Then go to your console which could be a PS4, PS5, Xbox or Nintendo and choose manual settings for the connection. Then select automatic or default option for all of the settings but select use or manual for proxy settings. Here you need to enter host IP and port which we had in proxy application. Then test internet connection to see it's fine. If you enable any VPN turned off and try to test without VPN because some VPNs doesn't share the connection so after you made sure it's working without VPN go to your VPN application only some good VPN support sharing which I mentioned them in the comments because this video isn't sponsored by any of them for example this one if I go to settings there is an option and if I enable multicast discovery I can share it with other applications now I connect to pair server and test internet again to make sure that it's working as you can see connection is successful so let's go to the next step to make sure that the vpn is affected on console you can go to a browser if your console doesn't have a browser it's okay you can test it on game but on ps4 for example i have browser and i can search for where is my location it will show your location based on your ip address you can see it's showing paris but if i just turn the vpn off and try again and reload the page it shows new york city and you can understand that your ip changed to default so if it shows your current location you are not connected to the vpn if i connect it again for example to london and try to reload the page again it shows i'm in greater london which means it's using vpn right now you can also test it by searching for ip address but here are some important questions and answers and tips what's the difference between http https or sox proxy the main difference is HTTP only works with web page and some applications like YouTube and other applications but it might not work with all of your games. But the Sox proxy can work with any application, any traffic that you send through that. It doesn't matter if it's a game or web application or anything else. It can support any traffic without any limits. So should you use HTTP or Sox proxy? Unfortunately on PlayStation, 
it doesn't support Sox proxy so you need to use HTTP but I don't know about Xbox or Nintendo if they support Sox proxies of course you should use Sox proxies they are better and they will affect on your games if after connecting the VPN your connection on any console fails make sure that you are using a VPN which supports sharing for example the VPNs that I did mention them in the comments below and also in the description if your connection fails even without vpn you need to make sure that both console and phone are connected to the same router what if you are using sim card 3g or 4g or 5g connection on your phone it's so simple all you need to do is to turn on your mobile hotspot on your phone then connect your console to the hotspot then search for the gateway on your console and do the rest of the things like we did at the beginning but i said http and https doesn't affect on games right yes that's right and it means when you use http it only affects on web page but not your games is there any way to fix it and the answer is again yes there are actually two ways to fix it the first way is to root your phone which is for another tutorial because with a rooted android phone you can simply share vpn without any issue no need to use any proxies but if you don't want to root your phone and i don't recommend it also i recommend you to share vpn from pc or laptop if you have any on your house because with pc or laptop you can simply share any vpn to any console that you have and if you are wondering how to do it, I did make another tutorial for you how to share VPN from PC or laptop or your router to any console that you have. So if you have one, go ahead and check it out. Link is also in the description below. Thank you so much for watching.